And welcome back to Mississauga Steelheads Hockey right here on Rogers TV Peel. I am joined now by a gentleman who is no stranger to this broadcast, Steve McLean, co-founder of the OHL Fanboy Podcast. Steve, so thanks so much for joining us. Wow, thank you guys for having me on once again. So I need you to remind fans, Steve, I know you've joined the broadcast before, but what exactly is the OHL Fanboy Podcast? How did you come up with it? And how has it been rolling along? Just a fan of the OHL and, and like to do more than just come to the games and cheer for my team. So a, couple, a few years back, started a podcast with my friend Brian Thompson. I'm a Storm fan. He's a Spitfires fan. And we just kind of talk one hour a week about all things OHL. And it's been going on for nearly three full seasons now. Had our 100th episode with uh, guest Jeff Merrick from Sportsnet last week. And episode 101 just actually came out this morning. So uh, OHL Fanboys. Dot com. You can listen to, to uh, this week's episode and all past episodes. Well, that is fantastic. How important do you think it is to this league to have that kind of publicity and getting attention from a podcast like yours? I, I mean, I know not tons of people will listen because it's also just kind of going by word of mouth. But at the same time, this league does need more coverage because it seems like whenever you hear stuff on the radio, it's more of the sometimes more negative stuff like concussions and fights and stuff. So we, you know, we talk about that as well, but we try and talk about things that maybe as fans, we don't hear about much in the media and we don't really interview players or anything like that. Same answers over and over. It's just we try and get something different out of things. So, Steve, you're actually here to promote the CHL Memorial Cup breakfast, which is obviously going to be taking place during the Memorial Cup down in Windsor this season. What can you tell fans about that? Well, the Memorial Cup fan breakfast, uh, a whole bunch of CHL fans from across the country go to the Memorial Cup every year, no matter where it is. And a few years back, they started this fan breakfast where on the first weekend of the Memorial Cup, everyone gets together and we just kind of get together, share a meal. And we all wear our team jerseys. This, I'm not a Rockets fan, but you know, we all wear our team jerseys. And then we started uh, raffling off uh, prizes and people would, all the fans who showed up would donate prizes. And, all, and starting actually in 2011 here in Mississauga, we started raising money for local charities for kids to, who may not be able to play hockey, but play local sports. And that first year we raised over $1,600 for, for local charities here in Mississauga. And it's gotten to the point where just a couple years ago in Quebec City, we raised over $5,800. And last year for Kids Sports Red Deer, we raised $10,250. So it's become this, this amazing thing. It gets bigger and bigger every year. And now we're getting uh, you know, donations from teams. This Mississauga Steelhead's actually donating some ticket vouchers for next season uh, for next season for the for the breakfast so people can win those among lots of other things like game worn jerseys sticks uh, any type of memorabilia not just chl stuff nhl stuff as well a very fantastic initiative there so steve if fans want to contribute they want to donate where can they head and how can they get involved well there's a few different ways to contact us best way memcupfan at yahoo.ca just email us there if you want to donate anything or if you want to come to the breakfast of course it's going to be this year sunday may 21st at the royal canadian legion branch number 255 in windsor uh, you know, it's going to be a great event, and if you want to come to that, it's $20 for entry. You can bring whatever prizes you want. So, uh, they may get raffled, they may be used as door prizes. Everyone usually walks away with some type of prize, so it's just a great event. Uh, you could also, we just started a Twitter page actually, so at Memorial Cup Fan on Twitter, and then uh, of course a Mem Cup Fan Breakfast on Facebook as well. So we're going to post all the info there if I'm talking too fast and people miss it. So it's going to be a great event. We hope everyone uh, can come out and uh, support some great causes this year. Okay, Steve, so you talk prizes. You got to sweeten the pot a little bit here. Do you know what prizes are available right now to kind of entice fans to get out there? Well, I know myself personally, I'm donating a, a signed uh, team jersey. I won't say what team it is, but, uh, and we've been coming, we've been asking some uh, teams, not just in the OHL, but across the CHL for donations, anything they can donate. As I said, the Saga Steelheads are in. I know the Flint Firebirds uh, are in on it as well. We've been talking with the Owen Sound Attack. So it's, it's uh, great, and hopefully some other teams get back to us. And usually there's just some things that come out of left field that fans from across the country will bring. And I said, it's not just hockey stuff too. We've had a lot of really high-end electronic stuff. Uh, iPads and Blackberries. Uh, well, I guess that's not too current anymore, but uh, just uh, just amazing uh, some of the stuff that you see there. And, you know, uh, it's just a great cause that we're raising it for. Well, thank you very much, Steve McLean, for joining us right here. Fans, be sure to tune in to the OHL Fanboy Podcast and get out to this CHL Memorial Cup Fan Breakfast. We'll be right back with much more Mississauga Steelheads hockey right after the break.